Hello to the channel Body With Your Body. Today, because we are friends with our bodies, we are going to talk about non-toxic uh, household or possibilities, how to use different kind of sort of like chemicals than the, the ones which you know for cleaning and washing and so on in uh, stores. It's very good to think about washing liquids and all these things which we use for our dishes and everything it still comes in contact with our bodies for example you clean this cup with uh, some really good detergent which cleans it amazingly but still there stays something on the cup and everywhere else and it's also going somewhere so it goes to the drain and into the water and it stays in the water and it has to be degraded and dissolved sort of in water which is never going to happen in 200 years when you use some of those bad chemicals in your detergent so i very much recommend to use eco-friendly products it's great for you but it's also great for the water and for the nature right because mm -hmm. if it goes into your system in a mini tiny micro doses it still uh, can create some interaction just um, i could mention homeopathics are also about this right you have a micro uh, information about these things in your in your sugar pills and you take it and it's uh, influencing your whole system so just uh, think about that and also if you wash your clothes i got some clothes from my aunt and I couldn't wash the smell of the detergent for five or six washings. I just couldn't take that detergent, the chemical smell off. I actually started to be more aware about these things in my household and what I clean with and what I wash my clothes with when I started to have certain reactions in a department when you go to the store and when you walk through the aisle where there are washing detergents cleaning and cleaning products. cleaning products and also especially the powders for washing mm -hmm. uh, for washing laundry there I got really like problem with my breathing and I didn't know what it is and you know because it was strange and then I had some health issues and um, there it was recommended everywhere I studied that if you have health issues you should really change detergents into the very very mild ones or use really really small tiny amounts or none of those. It's really good to trade it for baking soda, citric acid and vinegar. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, you just got a huge delivery, right? Yeah. Baking soda and vinegar, and you're yeah. as excited as uh, somebody you, else would be about a purse. You need to. You need to really. Also, it's chemicals. You have to do some. You know, you have to make some rules about using these. You studied on the internet. It's all over the world. Now it's very popular. It doesn't harm water. Citric acid is also used for our food to conserve our food. So if we use it to clean a toilet or washing machine and so on, it's it's amazing. And it does a really great job. Even you don't have to buy expensive cleaners for toilets and so on. It's just really doing the work amazingly. But uh, very good to study about it a little bit. Just like read a few articles and so on to be very well educated about what you're using. And then it's going to be your cheap friend forever, because w what else you need is uh, nothing more. You know, you just don't have to spend crazy money for these chemicals, which are super dangerous to have at home, especially if you have animals or kids. Mm. And a yeah. lot of those, a lot of those <clears throat> brands and famous products, they also contain vinegar, or citric acid and... Yeah. I actually, yeah, I actually was cleaning windows and I used vinegar or, or for my for my mirrors as well. I used vinegar and it was polishing amazingly. So I was like, wow, do you see these, you know, and it's just fun to play with it and fun to discover what what 
like what it can do and it's so cheap and easy and uh, really if you get into that world you will be super interested and super hooked mm -hmm. and also i wanted to say about the clothes because if you have it on your body all the time and there is this detergent with, which creates really a breathing problem just try to be closed in one room with open open bag of of detergent don't try that you will be really feeling like you can't breathe imagine what it does when it's on your clothes and you put it on your body like your body has to have a really big problem to breathe to detoxify because the body detoxifies all the time and it it, it sucked in the, the skin through the skin you you take in the most chemicals and also good things into your body so choose wisely and think about it how the body feels when you put on it something which is not that attractively smelly smelling great or something but it's still more loving than for the body you know we are not animals who are dressing into the perfumed things when our neighbor with baby which is like three to three months old walked around us and she smelled like really really far away about uh, with her perfume and really freshly washed clothes and everything and it's it's called attractive smell in our planet and uh, yeah it is really nice that some people wash their clothes and they are smelling very attractively but the baby doesn't smell the mother at all through these layers of perfume and detergents and everything and the child has to smell you like your body and animals have to smell you and your partner has to also sometimes smell you i'm not saying to sweat and not wash not shower and anything but you have to be sure that the person you are next to smells you and because then you will know if you are compatible and mm -hmm. uh, it's really being tricked the the sense of compatibility through our senses is being tricked with this and then some people can't have babies and so on because they are just not compatible and they would smell differently to each other when they would meet or something mm -hmm. oh you brought this mostly to light i was using chemical cleaners before Me I was too. with you and also I like the idea of really not scrubbing like crazy with some uh, little vinegar I would rather have a really strong aggressive chemical cleaner so things are actually clean but uh, yeah you brought this to light you don't like the smell of it mm. and I also don't like it anymore yeah yeah, because you started to be aware of the smell. Mm -hmm. And also, always used it without gloves. Yeah. I never put on gloves. So it goes into your body and into your bloodstream and then your body has to detoxify mm -hmm. it, right? Yeah, I also use these products. That's why I started to have a reaction on those because once I was cleaning a floor with a toothbrush, I wanted to be a great girlfriend. So I was cleaning a like, really, really big floor with toothbrush and with like the sand which is cleaning the between the tiles you know the, the stripes or mm -hmm. so the lines and then i started to have a breathing problems because i did it whole day mm -hmm. or, or a few mm -hmm. hours and uh, that was a big eye opener for me and mm -hmm. I, until today i can't smell that product it's called silit mm -hmm. yeah if we wouldn't want to eat it the product if we wouldn't want to put it on our body as a cream or if we wouldn't want to have it in a air diffuser to smell it then we probably shouldn't use it for cleaning mm. as well and also the white vinegar is great you can make it nicely smelling with essential oils and it will do the work mm -hmm. and uh, it also can use be it can be used as a softener it smells aggressive but yeah if you if you dissolve it in you, water you eat it as well yeah, but you have to dissolve it in water. You mm -hmm. can't use the whole concentration only for I'm first not the certain specialist. Things. Yeah, but uh, you also prefer it now, no? Yeah. 
because mm -hmm. you have no choice. We will see, yeah, because we will I see, wouldn't talk to you then. We will then. see how it will do the job when we replace it with the dishwasher tabs. Dishwasher tabs, I'm not really keen on. Really, no, I'm not going to make them yet. We don't have a dishwasher now, so it's good. We use ecological dishwasher tabs still, but uh, I also, I we already also use soap. We for dishwasher? Have, no, for dishes. No, I have a soap, which is uh, like a very... It's for dishes. It's a dish detergent. Mm -hmm. But it's we also a, a special one. It's not a chemical. No, it's very mild and very good even for babies. You mm -hmm. know, and if you don't have a chance to buy anything, you can buy also at, at least babies' uh, products, like for mm -hmm. washing dishes and so on. At least. I uh, often see Petra at the baby corner choosing creams for her yeah or something so not oh not no do, you don't have to say that <laughs> yeah uh, also we can talk about cosmetics someday you know uh, what it c uh, contains but now we are at the detergents and the non-toxic household and uh, it really really good does good things mm -hmm. and also your body will thank you to use it if you have like hormonal imbalance and you are washing your laundry in a great stuff, like the ones which are sold in supermarket, those powders or those liquids. And you wonder why you have like constantly yeast infection, ladies, or hormonal imbalances, why you can't be pregnant. Men are wearing the, the shorts which are washed in a absolutely crazy detergents and uh, and uh, with those softeners, you know, and uh, then it gets into the body, you know, and mm -hmm. you try it, try it and let it wash away. The vinegar also is being used used in a dish in a washing machines to wash this detergents off, but it takes like f at least six cycles of the washing machine washing to remove the the residues of the cleaning products or washing products. Just go into some ecological store, some e organic store or e-shop. They most often have sustainable products. Yeah, but try to go... The, the more ingredients the product has, the worse, the worse it is. And if you have like three ingredients there, maybe you could just combine it at home or just use one or two and think about uh, what else is needed and some of those ecological products are um, expensive for no reason like too expensive so mm -hmm. don't get yourself tricked but you check it and the less the ingredients lines are or th there is only one that is the best for you we also have an animal we have an uh, we have a dog and i realized that even though I used to like to wash her laundry, I've we've been together with my dog, now our dog, uh, 13 years. So um, I, I also think that they can smell everything much better than us. And uh, it's better to make her blankets to wash in a soft, uh, very sensitive d detergent, which is ecological. And she can still be a little stinky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I hope that this video inspired you how to be better buddy with your body and if you have any questions or your experiences or if you will have some health benefits or maybe finding a new partner benefits partner yeah. benefits yeah because you can find a partner correctly you, cool. if you don't use any drugs oh, with the smelling and mm -hmm. with the smelling write it into the comments see you next time